welcome. This is Melissa Arm of the Stock Swish. I'm looking at FDX. Really nice gap today that had a very, very uh, bearish opening and then didn't really go anywhere. And I ended up calling a put in this and a short. The put is still on, but not for a long time. I really don't like this gap. So let's just go over what happened in this today. If you day traded it and got out fast, you made money. If you held it, you lost. Uh, so I think everyone fared differently in this today, but I really thought that it had a long, long way to go. I mean, down. <clears throat> and it just it just sidelined pretty much all afternoon. Here's the drop. And this is not nothing. I mean, I'm, I mean, it's, this was, you know, $2, depending where you got filled, a buck, buck and a half. But I honestly had such high hopes for this to just completely fall off a planet. And it did not. And so at a certain point in here, when it rallied back, it looked like it was going to do great. It looked amazing. It looked beautiful. It looked perfect. You could have even taken more. It even looked good here after 10 o'clock. Here, here it's the sidelining. And then this is this, all of this in here. And then everything still looks good. I mean, this looked good for so long. And then it wasn't right. So there was a fed minutes announcement today that lifted the market and with it fdx but to be honest with you i believe that if that hadn't happened this would have broken down at some point in the afternoon it didn't play out that way so if you get out in the morning with the quick drop made a buck whatever a buck and a half you fared well and made money in fdx short today it was definitely not a long though it just didn't have the follow through to any bigger number to the downside so if you held it you got stopped we'll see what we get tomorrow I think the put in this really still could probably go tomorrow on its own without the market. But I guess we're going to have to wait and see. So good luck, everyone. We will see what we get tomorrow morning.